This is the signature style of Miss Rachel. Look at that goddess. <laughs> channel if you're new here smash the subscribe button down below and don't forget to hit that notification bell because we post three videos every single week that was where i did with myself <laughs> so today's video we're gonna be pulling out a throwback we had a couple of requests on lucas doing a voiceover for my makeup as you guys know lucas is og at knowing his girl so let's see if he could do a great voiceover with me doing my makeup this is the only time you're gonna hear me talk so just enjoy this nice soothing Voice, you ready? La 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 la. Did you enjoy it? Well, good. Let's get started on this video. Alright, <clears throat> right, guys, this is where I come in. She's she's locking up the key, she's throwing it away, she's you know rubbing her face because that preps the pores for the you know the makeup that she's about to put on. She's got her first weapon of choice, it is this pencil thing right here. Let me see where she goes with this. It is, drum roll, do, 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 lip line, no, nose, ah. eyebrow pencil. <laughs> so she got the eyebrow pencil out. So as you can see, she has some eyebrows there. You can kind of see them, but she's about to fake it till she makes it. The first time I ever saw her come out with some eyebrows on, I was shook it. I didn't know you could make fake eyebrows, but it looks like she really has eyebrows. Boom, look at that. Hey, hey. Moving on to our next one. Okay, she's got the, the B52143 from Morphe Products over here. Okay, so she's got the, I'm pretty sure this is called highlighter, guys. I know the, the liquid stuff is either highlighter or foundation from my limited knowledge of what she does. All right, she's spraying it. She's squirting it on there. Now she's gonna take this paintbrush right here. Oh, okay. She is, she's highlighting her eyebrows. So she's gonna make sure that you see what she just did. She made sure, she's like, okay, so you see I have, I had no eyebrows, now I have eyebrows, I'm gonna make sure you look at them because I'm gonna highlight them super bright. But you see how defined that is? And it doesn't look like that's gonna look good at all. I can't tell if she's joking here or if it's just gonna turn out good. I guess we're gonna have to stay tuned to the end to find out. Now she's doing the other one, you gotta match it up. By the way, this is gonna be a 12 hour video, so make sure you grab some popcorn, buckle up. If you haven't, hit that like button already. Go ahead and just, just lightly tap it right now. She's got the, the 12 volume master paintbrush here. What she's doing now, this is a technique called blending. Wow, look at that. It looks like those are your real eyebrows. Wow, I can't even, mm, that's amazing. I don't think I've ever sat here and actually watched the entire process because I normally fall asleep because I'm so bored. Boom, she's happy because now she has eyebrows. Oh, almost dropped that. Okay, we've got the product 12X10. Okay, we're gonna put that on there as well. This is called foundation. Oh no, uh oh. She got some makeup in her eye, gal. Oh no. This could be devastating. Now she's gonna, she's gonna dab it on there. A little dab it, dab it. Okay, you gotta get the whole forehead, y'all. We gotta make sure we don't leave any skin out. Now, this is where the this is where the artwork comes in. She's just gonna paint her whole face. All right, so as you can see here, she's just constantly rubbing her eyes. That's how you get makeup in your eyes, y'all. So I don't know if that's a common thing, or maybe y'all are learning from her mistakes right here where she's just rubbing makeup all in her eyeball, because I'm pretty sure that's gonna burn later. Getting around the nose, the other eye, you gotta make sure you get it in both eyes. You gotta make sure you blend it in with the hairline there, the forehead, get all the shininess out. He feels me, he feels me. So just like with makeup, in life, the foundation is the rock. It's what you build your house on. If you have a weak foundation, you're gonna have a weak face. You know what I'm saying? Boom. All right, now you guys see, look at the flawlessness. Look at the beauty. Look at the glamour. I think we need like a montage in here. We are grabbing... Highlighter again, I think. Okay guys, yep, she went for the highlighter again. We're highlighting more features now. She's making a, the T, the lowercase T here to make sure to highlight the nose, the lips, the eyes. So now, she's gonna blend that in a little bit. It is really amazing. I believe that they make a T down their face so it just brings some attention to the symmetry of the face. She's probably getting close to done already. I mean, look at her already. She's already gorgeous. And we're back at it. So now this is uh, this is powder right here. 
So she's got a little powder brush. She doesn't really know if that's the right brush based on her mannerisms here. Oh, fish face. So we gotta make the fish face here, suck the, suck the cheeks in. That way it gives an accentuation of your cheekbones. You see that? So this technique right here is called outlining. More blending. You gotta make sure you blend, guys. So all these different layers, they come together and then you just have this masterpiece at the end. Okay, good. We got the lashes here. We got the luxurious lashes. That's about to take your face from 10 to 100. Watch this whenever she puts this on. Uh-oh, you put way too much glue, guys. See now, you gotta put the glue on the lashes so they stick to your real lashes. I'm having way too much fun with this. She went for the phone. I know it's because she normally uses the mirror and you get all up in the mirror like you're about to kiss it. Uh-oh, nope, she's gonna use the mirror. We'll be back in a minute. Boom, we're back at it. She just used the mirror, she came back. Look at her, she's about to fly away with them butterfly wings on her eyes. Flippity flippity flap flap flap. Next, we got another pencil here, guys. The first one was brown, this one's black. Let's see where she goes with this. Oh, oh, she jogged me out again. I thought that was gonna be a lip liner, even though she doesn't wear lip liner. All right, so she's putting it on her eyes. This is called eye liner, because you're lining the eyes. Makes sense? Keep up. Oh, she's about to fly away, she gotta be careful. Okay, now we're putting it on the other eye. If you guys haven't seen, she actually put makeup on me in one video like early in our YouTube career. This was the most torturous part of the entire process. I felt like she was jabbing my eyes out. I can understand what you girls go through. It's horrible, I appreciate y'all, but man, I couldn't do this. Okay, so now she's putting it on the top of the eye there. Ooh, after that eyeliner, it really brings out the eyes, guys. Look at her, everything's just popping right now. Next, we have another brush. She don't know what that thing is either. Neither do I. We have here the palette. All right, so she's gonna take this palette and pick a color, any color, and... Oh, another tap, guys. That's what activates the makeup. If y'all didn't know, now you know. All right, she's putting it on the eye right there. This is called eyeshadow. So she's making sure that there's no shadows on her eye because it's gonna be nice and bright now. Tap, tap. This is the thing she's been doing recently that I really love. I don't know, it just adds a little color to the eye, but it's not over the top. It's just nice, a little feature that just really makes your eyes pop. Look at that. I really like this. All right, so we're adding a little more up there. Gotta get the whole thing all the way up to the eyebrow. Look at that. Mmm. Wow. She is feeling herself, y'all. I am feeling her right now. She is licking her lips and, and moving her eyebrows around. All right, you guys, we got some lipstick here. First thing we're gonna do is we're gonna smother this on my nice juicy lips. That's right, mm, look at that. Now I know that this is about to be a fancy date we're gonna go on if she's wearing lipstick. You gotta make sure you clean up the lip line there. You gotta suck your lips in so you can make sure you get it nice and tight. Get it right, get it tight, feels me. Now we have a, a burgundy. She's gonna layer this on top of the other lipstick. Oh, and I got like a two-tone beautiful color there. That is sexy. Boom, you gotta, like you got chapstick. Mm -hmm. Wow. You, ladies and gentlemen, I think this is our finished product. Making sure everything's right, you gotta look in the mirror. Oh! <laughs> now that she ripped off her, her headband, so now we're gonna put some water, some hair moisturizer. She's got her oil out. We're about to give you the hair too. So we're gonna get the whole thing. So the shoelace, that's the most important part of this whole process. So first off, we gotta put the oil on the scalp. Now we gotta spray some water. Make sure all those oils soak in. We got the Cantu products here. Make sure the hair is nice and moisturized. Ooh. Now, I know this feels good. You saw that? You saw that pro move, how she blocked off her face because she didn't want to spray water on her face? That was a pro move there for you. We're bringing you guys some knowledge today. All right, so now we're about to undo these braids real quick. So we got the first braid out. We're gonna spray some more water in it and some more moisturizer here. Our hair is gonna look really healthy after all of this. So that's the first braid down. We're about to start on the second braid, y'all. Hey, we got the mohawk going. That's our first style. We're about to bring y'all the mohawk. Okay, so you guys can kind of see we're getting somewhere. We got half the product done now. And we're working on the third braid. Third braid undone. Moisturizing in effect. We got the half fro, half mohawk look going right now. That's the all the kids are wearing nowadays. It's the cool style. We're starting on the fourth and the last braid right here. One more time and then we're gonna get into the hairstyle. Some more water, some more moisturizer. Shout out to Cantu if they wanna sponsor us. You know, that's cool. She puts a little bit of oil in her hands and makes sure to get all the edges to seal in that moisture. The oil helps seal it in. He feels me. All right, rubbing it in, making sure her hair is nice and healthy and thick. She is feeling it. Look at this beautiful natural hair. Yes, ma'am. So now she's fingering through her hair, making sure it's nice, everything's nice and together. 
looking right, looking tight. Shoelace time. Fun fact, if you guys lose your shoelace, you could just find an old shoe in the closet and take it out and then boom, you got another shoelace. Or you can get your husband to find it. These are new. All right, so now we're pulling this shoelace nice and tight. You gotta make sure to cut off all the circulation in your head so it's nice and it looks nice and tight. If you don't have a headache, you're not doing it right. Okay, so she looped it around, tucked it in, and now we got the nice beautiful afro puff in the back. This is the signature style of Miss Rachel. Look at that goddess. Mm. Beautiful. She's feeling herself, y'all. Can we get a round of applause? Oh, uh-oh. We got some, some dust on the shirt. It's from all the makeup. You know, every time you tap it, you're gonna get a little dust on you, so you gotta be careful. Making sure it's a nice, beautiful Afro puff, and ding, take a picture. All right, so what do you guys think about her makeup tutorial here? What do you guys think about my commentary? Leave a comment in the comment section down below. So you guys can give a zero to 10 comment down below for her makeup tutorial and a zero to 10 for my commentary. All right guys, we love you so much. You guys make sure you hit that notification bell so you don't miss any of our upcoming videos. All right, we love you guys. We'll see you in the next one, bye.